Hi guys, my name is Freddy and in this video series I will explain all the elements of the free Elementor page builder. In my opinion, the best page builder for WordPress. You can get it through ferdicorp.com forward slash Elementor. You can download it, upload it to your website and learn a ton of stuff about Elementor on this YouTube channel. If you like this video, please like it and if you are new here, please consider to subscribe for more upcoming WordPress tutorials. Now let's get started. In this video we will take a look at the icon list. So I search for icon list and there it is. I drag it over here to the new section and here it is list item 1, 2 and 3. Let's take a look at the layout. You can change it from a list like that beneath each other to inline. So that's also a possibility. I will choose for the default version. So we can choose an icon and a text. So I click on the first one. I can say I'm 31 years young. I can link it to something. I do not want to do that. And if you want to link it, you can open it in a new window. I close this one and now I can choose an icon. So maybe I choose for an hourglass. Let me see. Like that. I close it. Then I go to the second one. I am married to Anna. Maybe something with a heart. No link. The third one, I see myself as a web designer. Let me search for address. And I can add a new item or I can duplicate the latest one. So I see myself as a photographer like that. I search for a camera. And mostly, I see myself also as a teacher. I love to teach people about all kinds of things. Maybe something with lecture or graduation. Yes. And for the first time, I say it public on the internet. I'm going to be a soon to be dad. Yes, we're pregnant. We're so happy. What goes with that? Hey, this one. Perfect. So we have a list over here. And again, you can put it like that in line or beneath each other. I update it. And right now it looks like this. Let's design this. I go to style, the space between the icons. I do it like this. I can align them at the left, at the center and at the right. I prefer left. We can have a divider. And you can change from solid to dotted, make the weight bigger, change the color, change the width and bring it back to solid or just turn it off. I don't want to use it. Then we go to the icon. I think it's a bit small. So I go to the size. I can make it bigger like that. We can change the color to green, for instance. But when people hover over it, they can see it in blue like that. Then we go to the text. The text color is okay. And when you hover over it, I can also say make it blue like that. Then the text indent, the space between the icon and the text. Give it some space. And then we can go to the typography. We can change the font, change the size. Maybe I want it to be uppercase like that and then I go to the text indent and bring it back a little bit. So I like it, but it can be better. Let me see. It looks like that. What I want to do now, I want to add a background to it. So I go to the section, stretch the section, make the height minimum 800 like that. I go to the style. I choose a background and I go for an image in the background. I have it already over here. I insert the media. Now it looks like that. I scroll down and I go for the size cover. There we are. And the position center right. So I focus on the right area and now we are in the center. But now those colors do not appeal that much. So I click over here again, I go to the style, 
I go to the icon and I want the color to be white. Like that. And when you hover over it, it becomes blue. And for the text, the same thing. The text color should be white. And when you hover over it, it should still be white. Like that. Update. Let's take a look. And one more thing, I want the background to be fixed. So I click over here on the section settings, go to style and say attachment fixed update. And there we have it. I think it looks beautiful. And that's what you can do with the icon list element. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. I hope you learned a ton of good stuff and feel free to like this video and subscribe for more upcoming videos and then you will see me the next time. Bye bye.